During the past two decades, Nigeria has experienced tremendous economic growth and continues to show promise for even more growth. But even though Nigeria has witnessed unprecedented economic growth, problems of insufficient and epileptic power supply have continued to limit industrialization and would, on the long run, our ability to sustain economic growth. The tangled complexity of the power authority along with the slow bureaucratic processes meant that no investor would want to invest in Nigeria's power sector. The power reform policies of the Jonathan administration has, however, turned our fortunes around. Nigeria is now steadily and significantly improving her capacity to generate and distribute power. By unbundling the power sector and by the introduction of private sector investment, the tangled mess of both infrastructure and management has been replaced by more efficient regional hubs. This is steadily improving our capacity for power generation and supply in many areas. And as Nigeria grows as a major world economy, so also is our need for power growing. But with the implementation of the Jonathan Power Reforms, Nigeria's power capacity will have effectively doubled from 5,500 megawatts in 2015 to 11,500 megawatts in 2020. The fundamental nature of the restructuring in the power sector by the Jonathan administration has not gone unnoticed by the international community as noted by this quote in a recent article of Washington Times. There is still work to be done, but under Jonathan, it's very clear that the future for the power sector and Nigeria is growing brighter. So let's keep Nigeria moving forward as we fulfill our potential as a nation through improved power. Vote good luck.